Yo 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 Good morning, Angela Yee. Angela Yee is not here. Oh, there she go. She's coming. The Breakfast Club, as you know, it is officially over. Today is Angela Yee's last day on the Breakfast Club. Yeah, today is Yee's last day. It's Friday! And Yee's last day! Oh my God, why am I here? Today is your last day. Where's Jasmine Brand? I see Jasmine out there. Jasmine, come here. Jasmine's got to do my job today. I told her everything. Nope, you can't lead the listeners like that. Nope. You got to give them one last day. Hey! Okay? So she gonna do the Yee Mix too? Yep, she's doing everything. <laughs> Jasmine, what are we talking about in front page news? <laughs> Jasmine said you gotta be kidding me. Jasmine thought she was coming here for emotional uh, emotional support, but you are making her work. <laughs> Why are you talking about Jasmine like she's a dog? Just I'm waiting now. for Jasmine to There's come no in. Yeah. Don't let her talk no about Jasmine like a dog, cause you know what happens with Jasmine. Yes, <laughs> sit down, Jazz. There's no I such thing as an emotional support so person. No, she really wants you to work. No. All right, Jasmine, here. This is what you're going to talk about. Ange. What? Just, oh, my God. Do you think this is any way for her to do her Brand. last show, Jasmine? No, I, I will be here for emotional support. I will I will chime in, but Ange, come on. We got to go out with a bang. Come on. I'm tired. Yeah. We gotta, it's my last day. It, it, you got it, girl. Got you got it. Yeah. You got, you got hoodies. We got, <laughs> we got we got Oh, y'all got Angela Yee hoodies. Look at Angela Yee. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. 90s Brooklyn paintbrush style. <laughs> Let okay. me see the front of that. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's Look at nice. That. Mm-hmm. Hey, fam. You're like an 80s girl. Mm-hmm. That's right. Hey, fam. I, I was hey born fam. in the 1900s. 1978. Angela Yee hoodies. I was too. Well, that you, what, took what are a we little planning. Page news? Huh? She mm-hmm. don't know. Uh, football. <laughs> Thursday night football. <laughs> that's my part. That's <laughs> my job. I know that. <laughs> Well, uh, uh, well, it's going to be one of those days. Yeah, y'all. It's, all right, it's all right. It's the last day. <laughs> and uh, get on the phone. 800-585-1051. If you want to speak That's to right. Angela Yee. If you want to talk to Jasmine Brand. If you oh want to talk to Yee, that today is her last day. You want to show her some love. You want to give her flowers. Whatever it may be, you can get on them phone lines right now as well. We got we some people checking in today. hours and hours. Yeah, uh, J- J- Jasmine might not be able to hold it down for you. The listeners will. <laughs> yes, the listeners. Hey, I'm sorry. <laughs> the I thought she was will. joking this whole time. I will chime in, Ange, but come on now. This is your last day, babe. You Get got it together. This. Get it together, friend. We did have a long <laughs> night, though. Where'd y'all go? We just had a few drinks. Oh, okay. No, it looked like more than a few. A little few drinks. That looked like well, way more than a few. Well, first of all, we did do two episodes of lip service after I left here yesterday. And then we said, let's go get some food and some drinks. And we, we were at the spot that you haven't been to yet in Brooklyn. Which spot? The Simpson. Oh, oh, Chef Simpson. Shout out to Chef Simpson. Caribbean, mm-hmm. Caribbean chef. Amazing food. Really? The food was really good. Yeah, yeah. he's cooked for me several times. And how was the spot? And Envy, by the way, took home six plates yesterday. Right? Envy, I couldn't even have none yesterday because you took all the food home. And the girl came and cooked and you had your empanada friends. What's the name of their You got to stop thinking about all your kids sometimes, bro. <laughs> huh? Sometimes you can't be thinking about all your kids. Envy right? took home six <laughs> to-go <laughs> plates. No, he I did. Mean, he, really he, did. he really did. I have video. I love Envy. Envy is consistent. Look, I Envy six didn't... kids. I got a family of eight in the crib. That, that... Did, they like like... The, did they like the food? What? They love the food. And then last night, you know, it was my dad's 80th birthday, so we took You did out. not I use that food Instagram. for the birthday. No, I you, took six, you, <laughs> you took six plates home, oh, even though that you gosh. was taking your daddy out for dinner. You knew you were taking your daddy and your whole family out for dinner, and you still took six plates home? One was for lunch, you gotta one was stop. for dinner. You got to stop. What did I say to Jasmine last night? I said, I can't believe we're paying for food. We had all this food, but Envy took it all home. <laughs> I thought, And I thought you were joking. No, no. I, I definitely took all the food. I don't too. know why Jasmine don't take me seriously about yeah, anything. I'm sorry. Okay. Look at you. Right now. <laughs> you look so unserious. All right. All right. Front page news is next. Wish us luck. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Let's get in some front page hey. news. Now, on Thursday night football, the Bills beat the Patriots last night 24 to 10. Mm-hmm. All right, Yee. All right, Yee. Come on now. It's your last show. Come on, Ann. Come okay. on. What you got? Well, let's go out with a bang. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, gas prices have plunged to the lowest level since February. You'll be excited to notice. Have y'all noticed that as you're getting gas? Uh, I don't really. know. I filled up the other day, and it still was almost like $100. <laughs> no, nah, not really. It's still expensive as hell. All right. Well, the decline in gas has happened. I did notice it. The, uh, it's like uh, for me to fill up my tank, it was like $12 less than it mm. has been normally. So... That's a good thing, right? 
Mm-hmm. All right, and there's avalanche warnings in four states now as it's been snowing. And so in uh, Colorado, California, Idaho, and Montana, there's been heavy snowfall in parts of each state. And in Colorado, extremely dangerous avalanche conditions are expected to form early today and throughout Saturday. And it could be both natural and human trigger avalanches. People are expected to go skiing this weekend. Uh, Several ski resorts have just opened. And so with additional snow and strong winds, that's going to be a already huge burden on an already weak snowpack. Y'all be going snowboarding and skiing and no, stuff? No, I never have. My wife wants to go skiing. You never been snowboarding or skiing? M- never. I have been before. My son wants to do it now, so I'm going to start getting him into it. Yeah, you, sh- you should get your kids doing that now so that later on... Yeah, my you kids get, love it. It's harder to learn as you get older because you, you're more nervous. Yeah, you have more, you're more fearful. That you're going to like fall and hurt yourself, and you probably will. But, yeah. All right. And um, Tesla has delivered its first electric semi-trucks promising 500 miles of rain. So Thursday evening, yesterday evening, Tesla made the first deliveries of these trucks five years after the heavy-duty hauler was first unveiled. The event included two truck cabs decked out in the livery of Pepsi and Frito-Lay. So okay. that's happening. The truck is supposed to be really, really good. Besides it's fully not electric. having gas, yeah. it's fully electric, and it has the self-driving option. So... If drivers are driving and they start to fall asleep, hopefully the Tesla controls will be able to make sure that driver doesn't crash. They said the braking um, is also going to be a safety benefit. The way electric vehicles use their motors to slow down and recharge their batteries Mm -hmm. using the vehicle's own motion. Because drivers won't have to downshift going down long hills and they may not need to use the truck's actual brakes at all. Yeah, I ordered one as well. Um, Yeah, it's supposed to be good. You ordered one of the semi Is it pricey? Uh, yeah, it is pricey, but it, it, I think it's going to be a good investment. Hopefully it is, because it's one of those things where it's like it, it'll keep insurance down because if a driver does fall asleep, that mm-hmm. self-driving app will, will help protect and save people on that road. And, you know, you save a lot of money in gas, so we'll see. You still got to have a CDL and everything, right? Yes, you right. still do. Yeah, they just did a presentation, and in the original presentation five year, years ago, they talked about the autopilot system, but it wasn't mentioned in this last presentation for mm-hmm. some reason. Eddie, bring ye balloons in here. Why ye balloons out there? Nobody can see them. Those are yesterday's balloons. You were in here. Yesterday. yesterday. Oh, we're those? talking about tomorrow. <laughs> oh, I didn't know those were here yesterday. <laughs> oh, I wasn't here yesterday. You're right. Okay. Right. Well, Jasmine Brand is here today, and everything that I don't feel like doing, I'm going to defer to her. <laughs> I feel like you're really serious. This is a little weird. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> You just gotta walk out, Jasmine. That's like, what I said. And I texted her and I said, "Hey, I said, hey, Ange, can I walk? Can I, I leave said, now?" No. And she said, "No." No, you just gotta walk out. Nope. You just gotta walk out. You gotta That's let that. her. You got. You gotta let her swim on her own. What'd you say about snowboarding? If you are scared to do it, she won't do it. What'd you say? <laughs> when you get older. I said you, you should have did it when you were younger. That's right. So you just gotta l- walk out and let her snowboard down the hill by herself. What food do we have today? You tell me. Envy, hey, well, Envy's just thinking about McDonald's. what he. <laughs> <laughs> Envy's just talking McDonald's about what he wants to day. take home, and Envy had them bring me empanadas of mostly things I don't eat. The empanadas were good though. They had lamb chop empanadas. I don't eat that. Oh, you don't eat red meat, yeah. Uh, what they else? Had you had? Seafood empanadas. I don't eat that. Turf. I was like, is this supposed to be for me? Uh, <laughs> it was some veggie ones, home. all right? Yeah, there was mm-hmm. a couple veggie ones. Mm-hmm. All right, well. You want to holler at ye, 800-585-1051. Today is her last day. That's right. Call her up right now. Show her some love. Talk to her. Give her her flowers. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Whoa. The Breakfast Club. This is your time to get it off your chest, whether you're mad or blessed. So you better have the same energy. We want to hear from you on The Breakfast Club. Hello, who's this? Hey, this is City Council President Mary Sheffield. How are you from Detroit? Hey, Mary Sheffield. I was just talking about you. No, she wasn't. <laughs> no, I was. I actually had a, I actually had a Zoom and um, with Daryl. I was just telling you about him and Envy. Yeah, what up, though? From Detroit. What up, though? Detroit, yes. I just wanted to call in and show some love from Detroit, Angela. You know you have uh, touched so many people. Your reach goes very far and impacts here in Detroit. Um, I know I speak on behalf of a lot of Detroiters um, that we love you, that we appreciate you in Detroit. Um, Not only have you invested in Detroit, but you have went above and beyond to support local businesses and just your entrepreneurial spirit has touched Detroit, Uh, your civic engagement. I know I've partnered with you several times, one of which was about getting out to vote and the importance of of, uh, just civic engagement. And so I just wanted to reach out and say thank you on behalf of Detroit for what you've done. We wish you the absolute best as you move forward. Uh, And I do have a testimonial resolution on behalf of the city council that I want to present to you. 
Uh, uh, that we'll so do nice. once, you, once you're back in the city, of course, to honor you. It's our highest honor that we can give. I know you've already received a spirit of Detroit Award. From you. Today. Thank you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. But we also want to present to you a testimonial resolution as well uh, that honors and memorializes your work. Uh, and what you've done, your impact, but then also uh, congratulates you and recognizes the work that you're going to do moving forward. Hey. Hey. Well, thank right. you, Mary okay. Sheffield. Right. Amazing. And we're going to do some hot yoga when I get back in town. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> looking forward to it. <laughs> All right. I'll be there this weekend, matter of fact. Okay. And I'll make sure we get it to you. All right. Thank you, thank, Angela. Thank you okay. so Peace. much. Peace. I appreciate you. No problem. Hello. Who's this? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, Oh, hi, hi. Oh, my God, I got through. Hi, my name is Kim. Just a long time ago, so I want to wish Angela you congratulations on all her new ventures. I'm a little nervous talking to you guys. So, no problem. Yeah. Uh, thank you. I appreciate you so much for calling in. Yeah, no problem. Hi, Charlamagne. Peace, Queen. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. I'm good. Just at work. All right, oh yeah. Mama, have a good one. What time you What time you get at work in the morning? One eight a.m. Woo! We thought we had it rough. She said one eight a.m. Yeah, one a.m. No, one a.m. Oh, one a.m. Got you, got you. All right, yeah. thank you, Mama. <laughs> get it off your chest. That'd be so Angel, disrespectful. Five eight five one zero five one. If you need to vent, you want to holler at ye. Today is her last day. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. I ain't doing nothing today. I ain't doing nothing today. <laughs> the Breakfast Club. I'm dialing. I'm dialing. Hey, what you doing, man? I'm dialing. I'm calling call, call you. This is your time to get it off your chest, whether you're mad or blessed. 800-585-1051. We want to hear from you on The Breakfast Club. <laughs> Hello, who's okay. this? Uh, this is Brian from Atlanta. Hey, Brian. What get up, off Brian? Your chest. What's going on, y'all? Good morning. Good morning. You know what I'm saying? Good morning. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Angelique. Hi. Are you sure you leave it today? Did you I sure you leave today? He yeah. said, are you sure you leave today? That's a good I'm question. I'm positive. That's what you've been saying. Look, I already done packed up all my stuff in this corner. No, you have not. Yes, that I corner have. looked the same way it looked <laughs> for the past 13 years. Ain't nothing changed in that corner. Now nah, the other the, that box is empty. I took everything out of it. There was nothing in the well, box. Well, <laughs> How do y'all know what's in the box? You're not supposed to touch it. He said he has a song for you. Oh, let's hear it. Please don't go. Oh boy. Please, please oh God. Go. She's definitely out now. She's running out now. <laughs> That's uh, it? Oh uh, no, I want to finish, but. You no, know, you finish. No, you no, finish keep and you're going. done. I no, like it. Horrible, bro. No, no, you finish I and like you're done. It. Now. It's going to hit different, hit different. The breath of club ain't going to hit the same no okay. more. I'm, gonna, I'm sorry. All right. Let's <laughs> OG Rob when you need him. Thank you, sir. Uh, Hello, who's this? Oh, my God, I made it. What's up, y'all? This is Valerie from L.A. I'm, I've been waiting. I'm sitting here calling at 3 a.m. just to wish Angela Yee all the best. I'm so excited for you. Thank um, you. Oh, my God. <laughs> Charlamagne. Yes, ma'am. I love you so much. I love you I love more. All of y'all. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you for taking my call. Um, I started listening to y'all or watching y'all on Revolt. Um, during the pandemic, I've been listening ever since, and you just bring so much joy to me during the day when I'm driving to work, wherever I am, and I just wish you all the best. I'm going to still be listening to DJ Emmy Charlamagne. I love y'all, bro, man, all day uh, long. It's going gonna, it's gonna to so turn up, trust me. I know it is. I can't wait, but I can't wait to listen to you, too, <laughs> on iHeart, Angela. And I Thank you. you. And I love y'all. Thank you. Right. To be clear, Thank yes, you, I'm still going to be on iHeart. I'll be on after the breakfast club. Way up with Angela Yee mm -hmm. in 30 plus markets throughout the country. Yes, and well rested. Yeah, we'll see about that. That's very debatable. <laughs> Hello, who's this? DJ Envy, Angela Yee, Charlemagne the God, it's OG Rob. Good OG morning. Rob, what up, King? OG this is what y'all was waiting for. They was waiting hey, for this. Listen. Angela Yee, it's the last day, baby. You already know what it is. Listen, listen. This right here is something special. Uh -oh. Um, I, I took my time with this because I wanted it to come out just right, and I wanted it to do it the Brooklyn way. So listen, Envy, real quick, right? I laid it down too. I got a beat behind it, and I want to send it to you so you can play it, man. Oh, oh, so, oh, you so you're not doing freestyles oh, you today, know, huh? Oh, you said in the songs now. No, I was now. doing freestyles. 
I can do the freestyle without the beat, but I'm gonna send you the music so you can play this because the world gotta hear this, man. This is special, man, for you, man. This is very special, man. Okay. Well, let's right. hear the freestyle. All right, I got the freestyle. Okay, listen. I said, sitting and contemplating on how to lay it out, I gotta give these flowers to ye. This is what I'm talking about. Hey. Educated from day one. It started in your home. Blessings just to shine your light. By staying in the zone, Wesley and his with them thoughts evolve and structure begin destined for greatness. Your skills sharpened up since then. From internships to working with Vine in the woo. Shout out to Paul. <laughs> Shade 45 and what it did for you. Always been a woman that stood tall and knew your worth. Even took a low pay scale just to make it work. Breakfast club on lockdown. You Charlemagne and then we got him in the frenzy. The whole world is listening now. And I know your moms and pops is proud. We feel the same way. Now we going way up with ye. Just check the resume. Add it to the front page news to get it off your chest and spread it like the rumor report. A chosen prospect. Accolades too. It's beautiful. Where should I begin? First ever ambassador for the libraries our kids is in. It's in bio. Life, hey. respect, respect <laughs> the wiki page. Legendary. Had to give you your own day in BK was necessary. Twelve years with your brothers connected job for the lifeline. We gonna miss you on at six to ten. But now it's your time. Bless for ye. Wow. Okay, OG Rob. I can't come behind that, OG. Pause. I got a bar. I got a bar. I got a couple bars. Yeah, go. I, oh, oh, oh. Two years ago, a friend of mine said she had to leave to get a show that's mine. So she wrote this rhyme that I'm about to say. The rhyme is called Envy's Too Gay. See, what? What? Why what? You to to me? what? This is about what? me. This is about me. I was wondering what? where it was, I was wondering where this was going. Now we got a real rapper here, Jasmine what? Brand. Don't do that. Now, Jasmine, we heard you rap at the uh, the cipher. Don't the embarrass BT me anymore, please. The BT award cipher. You got she some said, bars, Jasmine. She said I had the single most embarrassing moment of her I life. I have no, I have no bars. <laughs> <laughs> it was very embarrassing. I appreciate That's Ernest OG and Tasha Rob. for the opportunity, but it was very embarrassing. OG Rob, though, that was dope. You did that was amazing. Amazing. That was. He yeah, gave you your hard. own wiki page. I know. I'm using that in my bio. All right. Well, we got uh, you got rumors on the way? Or should I ask Jazz? Jasmine, what are we talking about? <laughs> What's we're on talking Jasmine about, brand this morning? We're talking about Kanye West, mm. oh boy. Chris Paul. Oh, boy. Minding his business. <laughs> Chris Paul minding his business. What else you got, Ange? There you go. That's perfect. Okay. Great tease. All right. All right. We'll get to that next. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. <laughs> the Breakfast Club. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV Angela Yee, Charlemagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Let's get to the rumors. Let's talk, Kanye. It's about time. What's going on? Yeah. Rumor report. Rumor report. This is the Rumor Report talk to him. with Angela Yee on the Breakfast Club. To be clear, again, today is my last day on the Breakfast Club. My final Friday. Um, Jasmine Brand is here to assist. I'm giving emotional support. There you go. Because you drunk from last night. So, as I should be. (laughs) As you should be. Jesus. Kanye's Twitter account has been suspended yet again after Elon Musk says it violated rules against incitement to violence. And so uh, he said, I tried my best. Despite that, he again violated our rule against incitement to violence. Account will be suspended. That's what Elon Musk tweeted in a reply uh, about you know, why his account was suspended. So, yeah, I mean... Is it going to be, you think, permanently, or you think it's going to be more like a... I don't know, but let's talk about what Kanye said as well, okay? All right, so Kanye was talking to Alex Jones mm, 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 mm. already, <laughs> and uh, he said that there is some good things about Hitler. Well, that's right. You're not Hitler. You're not a Nazi. You don't deserve to be called that and demonized. I see good things about Hitler also. The Jew, I love everyone, and Jewish people are not mm. going to tell mm, me, mm, mm, mm. you can love, you know, us, and you can love what we're doing to you with the contracts, and you can love what we're, you know, what we're pushing with the pornography. But this guy that invented highways, invented the very microphone that I use as a musician. Not true. You can't say out loud that this person ever did anything good, and I'm done with that. Every human being has something of value that they brought to the table, especially Hitler. How about that one? Ari Emanuel, how you like that one? Hey, Ron, you gonna do anything to fix Chicago? They wanna separate and confuse the Christians and make us afraid to stand next to each other. 
Oh, well, Van Lathan. Oh, my God. Yeah, Van Lathan told us uh, that he said that at TMZ in 2018, and other people have said that they heard him say that he celebrates Hitler, so do y'all believe it now? And also, man, Hitler did not invent highways, and he did not invent microphones, okay? I mean, even if he did, well, he didn't, so even, that's false information. Even, even if but... he did, that does not justify the murder of six million people. No. Like, come on, bro. And and by the way, the electric uh, electret microphone uh, that 90% of all mics use today are based on was invented by a black man. Okay, Dr. Hello. J- Dr. James West. <laughs> all right. Kanye would know that if he actually read a book. <laughs> all right. Come on, man. All right. Now, he also bought out a net as a puppet and then spoke as a puppet. And you said what? Is that a puppet? What, what do you call I that? I don't know. But he was mimicking Israeli Prime Minister. <laughs> Here you go. Tired of picking mm, up mm, mm, the mm. Yahoo and the Netting. So for now, he's just Netting. I know some people call him BB, but we're going to call him Netting. What you want, Netting? Hey, yay, yeah, right after this, I'm going to say you're crazy. I'm going to take your, your family away from you. We're not done with you yet. You cannot cross what the free hell? thought. We have to control the history books. We have to control mm, the banks. Mm, mm, and we mm, have to mm. go and kill people. And so we're in the bed very high. So, and in a little while, hopefully you're going to take the mask off. Because this, is this actually yay here? <laughs> Man, I've said it once and I'll say it again. Kanye West is moving like a person who doesn't feel like he's going to be here much longer. And it's sad that folks are just watching this like it's normal. That man needs to be committed to an institution. And we People are watching. should not be sitting down with him. No, man. Yeah. Dame Dash already told y'all that. Like, we are watching a manic episode in real time and it's getting progressively worse. And the pain that man is going through, he's projecting, you know, uh, on himself and everyone else. And it's not going in well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, and then uh, he had some things to say about um, being anti-Semitic. And then we're so-called free, but we're never free. And we're Republican, but then we're turned to Democrats at the MLK JFK time, right? And we're told we're black, and they made songs that said, say it loud, I'm black and I'm proud. And then crack came, and then rappers started saying, what's up, my I'm a you a okay, I'm a then. Wait a second, I thought was bad a second ago. No, is fine. That's what the feds told us to call ourselves. And then even Beyonce, we never thought she'd call herself a bitch. Everyone says, them, okay, now our black women are bitch, so we're bitches and bitches now, right? So I wake up, I look at my phone, and they say, yeah, he's an anti-Semitic. So I said, okay, well, I'm an anti-Semitic. No, you said you're, you said I'm an anti-Semitic. Get it? Bring in the clowns. There will be clowns. He's definitely a clown. And I know that y'all think this is just about anti-Semitism, but what Kanye is doing right now is more than dangerous. Like, in fact, it actually should be criminal. And black people and all other marginalized communities, if you think for one second, it will be safe for you in a country where Nazis and white supremacists are empowered and people are attempting to normalize Hitler, then you got your rabid ass mind. Yeah, I don't see how anybody can defend Kanye no. West. I will say he needs help. He yes. does. We've been screaming at He, de- he definitely I'll say help. that. Two things can be true, though. He can need help and, and he can be a Nazi. He can be a bigot. Mm-hmm. And y'all can say he's not a Nazi. He definitely got Nazi ideology. Well, he does say he likes Hitler. Exactly. How did Beyonce get dragged into this? He's dragging, <laughs> he's dragging everybody into it. Like, what? Well, here's what he had to say about Hitler. He's uh, And, you know, he said he loves Jewish people, but he also loves Hitler. Hitler, they gave him an award. I, I'm just saying, I don't like Nazis and I don't like what some of the mafias are doing either. I like Literally. Hitler. Mm. The man he led to like the murder of six million people. That's some awful. say some say eleven million. Okay, like come on, bro, stop. All right, dude, claiming to be a free thinker, but he's just repeating things that these white supremacists are telling him. And I'm at the point right now. If you intellectually align with Kanye West on anything, don't talk to me no more, bro. <laughs> Straight up, like don't. I don't even want to speak to you. Like me and you aren't even. We don't even got the same type of energy, the same type of the same type of spirit, because that man is so anti everything he hates his own people yeah you know what i mean he hates jewish people he don't he, you see how he attacked his uh ex-wife last night yeah the guy don't love nobody no period he doesn't at all he only needs, thing y'all should be doing is getting help. that man some help that's he it help. all right well that is your rumor report so, so you need, he, 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 shutting them up and getting them some help is all that needs to happen right now so stop giving man, them a platform that's yo. right that's right that man is a threat to himself and he's a threat to others well as long as the news keeps reporting it and the oh, blogs my. keep reporting it and, and people keep, keep on it. sitting oh, down and doing interviews yeah keep, keep, keep and us we just did a whole room report <laughs> as, 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 as long as we keep doing it you know. well at least he's off social it. media for now only time you, I feel like some of these things have to be 
you have to rebuttal some of these things, right? Yeah. You know what I mean? Because he has fans and he has oh followers yeah, he has that believe cult. some. Yes. Yeah, he does. He has a cult. That kind of believe a lot of this. That kind of. There are they people believe. that believe this. This is what he's saying. And that's what makes it dangerous. Coats are very dangerous. All right. And they all drinking the Kool-Aid. Well, that is your rumor report. That other voice you hear is Jasmine from so, the Jasmine brand. Sorry. Just in case somebody that just tuned in. Because today is allegedly Yee's last day. No, it's definitely. Allegedly. thousand percent. No doubt about it. <laughs> my last day. Ja- <laughs> Jasmine took Yee out last night. And Yee's a little uh, saucy. Uh, she's, you know, we had a good time. She's celebrating. Mm-hmm. So I'm here for emotional support. That's all. Thank you. Yee, do you know what's <laughs> Coming up in rumors, meaning in front page news. She don't even know front page news is next. She forgot. Look at her face. Wow. <laughs> I'm not, just, just, I'm just not, I'm, some more. I'm not some doing more donkey drinks. today either. I want y'all to know that. I'm putting it all no, on you. You gotta be no. here Monday. <laughs> just, let's give us some more drinks. What, what, what we got over there? No. I no. Got, nope. Mm-mm. No. Huh? It's your last day. <laughs> not huh? <laughs> if you could hug, you could hear. <laughs> you could hug, you could hear. Yo, she is twisted. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, we'll be back. Hopefully, it's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. The Breakfast Club. Your mornings will never be the same. In Pitch Perfect, Bumper in Berlin, Adam Devine's Bumper Allen moves to Germany in pursuit of stardom. With new friends, new rivals, and new music, Pitch Perfect, Bumper in Berlin hits all the right notes. Stream the original series now, only on Peacock. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV, Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Yo, Good it's morning. Angela Yee's last day. The Breakfast Club, as you know, it is officially over after it's today. It's my last day. I'm on a flight out of here today. And she, you're already drunk. I don't think they let drunk people on flights. She, I'm not drunk. <laughs> we'll be sober by the time it's time to get on the flight. Oh, you know okay. what? Jasmine Brand is here with me, and she's not drunk because she pretends to take shots, much like Envy used to. That's mm-hmm. right. Smart. Going, We're smart. Smart. I can't do it. All right, well, let's get some front page news. <laughs> the Bills beat the Patriots. Go, ye. How much? You know the Bills <laughs> is my team. Not how much. 24 to 10. What are they, 8 and 9 and 3? 9 and 3. Look at how I knew that. You didn't know that. Yes, I did. Up. You said 8 and 3. No, I said, then I said 9 and 3. Yeah, now. after he said 9. <laughs> well, because they were 8 and 3, and now they're 9 and 3. That's, yep. that's, yeah. how, that's, how, that's how numbers work. Let it go. Yeah. I don't see why y'all don't realize. You're Clearly drunk. I knew we what do I was realize you're drunky. We totally understand you're drunk. We realize that. Did I see what? Never mind. Okay, what you got? <laughs> All right, now let's talk some politics. According to a poll by CNN, Raphael Warnock holds a narrow edge over Herschel Walker. Mm, it's mm, the mm, final mm. undecided Senate contest. I can't believe that this is this close. But according to a, a new poll, uh, 40, 52% of likely voters say they plan to support Warnock. And 48% are picking Herschel Walker. It can go either way. I mean, because we shouldn't be here, right? Can you believe this? This is wild. Yes. <laughs> in America this, in see, this whole thing yes. feels like crazy. the Truman Show or something. Is that the name of that movie? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Where this can't be real life. There's a lot of things going are on. Are y'all right okay? I cannot believe people really. Are y'all, y'all okay? Well, are y'all okay? Wasn't well, President Obama in Georgia yesterday? He was again? yesterday. He spoke, to, uh, he spoke about Herschel. You got the audio? Because you ain't got blood go to it. Since the last time I was here, Mr. Walker has been talking about issues that are of great importance to the people of Georgia. Like whether it's better to be a vampire or a werewolf. This is a debate that I must confess I once had myself when I was seven. <laughs> then I grew up. In case you're wondering, by the way, Mr. Walker decided he wanted to be a werewolf. Which is great. As far as I'm concerned, he can be anything he wants to be. Except for a United States Senator. Now, now that is an excellent question. No, I used to oh, want to be a werewolf when I was young. I've told you all this story a million times. I wrote Did about you? it in my first book, Black Privilege. Yes, I you actually should talked about it a lot. Actually. That's right. I actually thought I was going to be a werewolf so much that uh, my ears started getting pointy one time when I was in, I think, third third grade. Wait, wait a minute. That didn't happen. Well, I was sitting at the lunch table and okay. I was telling everybody I was going to change at noon. And then, like, my, <laughs> I guess I believed it so much that my ears started to point a little bit and all the kids jumped up that didn't and happen. ran. You but, are lying. No, 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 your, no. Your ears did not transform. I, I can only tell you my truth, Jasmine. It's, and then, and then uh, later on in life, I realized being a vampire is way cooler. That's when I started I reading. I think vampire if I had a choice. What? Yeah, yeah, I would do vampire too. When I started reading all Charlene Harris novels, the, the, that's, those are the novels that True Blood was yep, based off. I wanted to be a vampire. Vampires way fly. And then remember people said you and Lafayette look alike? Nobody ever said it. You said that. Nobody ever nobody ever. A lot of people said no, it. Nobody ever said it. to Lafayette, by the way. What are we talking about, guys? I also do find it extremely sad that President Obama had to double back to Georgia to help Raphael Warnock defeat Herschel Walker. 
I'm <laughs> right. Like, Tuesday. Okay. Yeah. I mean, and then I'm just, I'm just telling you, it's because folks know what they're going to get with the Republican Party. They know that whoever is in that seat is going to vote however the rest of the GOP votes. So as long as you're down to do the bidding of the Republican Party, they're going to support you. So the belief is really in the Republican Party, not uh, Herschel Walker. Mm -mm. Okay, well, that is your front page news. Yeah, two, more, two more minutes, G. No, we don't. <laughs> we do. When is the election? The election is Tuesday, Tuesday right? Yeah. But the early Tuesday. election, the, yes. the early elections end already? Early voting was ends today. Early voting? I think, already. Today? Today. I think it ends today. Okay. Mm -hmm. D, mm -hmm. when does it end? Today. She don't know. <laughs> She, th and. she think you asked her about her her, her breakfast club run. That last day. Today is your last breakfast day. Club run? Today. Everything is today. Everything's today. Today. Well, right now, um, according to the vote, Raphael Warnock has forty nine point four percent. Herschel Walker already. has forty eight point five percent. You just said that. I said it off the air. No, you didn't. No, you, you said it, you said it on the air. You didn't. Say, she didn't say the number though. She said uh, it was a narrow Thank lead. you. I said it was yes. narrow. Now I'm telling you the actual numbers. Mm -hmm. Eddie, what are we doing next? We taking phone calls. We opening the phones, and we're gonna let people we're be call up and. Uh, Huh? Talk to Angelie on her last day. That's all, all right. we doing all day today. Y'all sound like a mess today. He's yelling at the studio. You yelling at him. Now, when we come Can back, y'all get it together. <laughs> now, yesterday we told you that you only had two, three friends, right? <laughs> but actually, you have four, and your fourth friend is going to be calling in when Who's we the come three? back. It was Destiny. Okay. Tashara. Okay. Jasmine. Okay. Melissa was here yesterday. You ruined a surprise. Why don't you? Yeah, just ruined a surprise. Well, you didn't hear. He didn't. Nobody heard him. Okay, all right. We heard him. Nobody <laughs> heard him. This is a mess, y'all. Y'all ain't hear it. Oh, my goodness. And we talking about it like y'all heard worried about clothes instead of producing the show. They made sure these hoodies got produced. Okay? The hoodies are very nice. <laughs> they, they look nice. nice. They didn't produce the show. Now, for people that just joining us, uh, we got Angela Yee hoodies on this look morning. Them, look really nice. They say, yeah. hey, fam. Really nice. hey, fam. Hey, fam. Hey, mm fam. -hmm. Those are actually nice. Juices for Life is on here, Charlamagne, too. Charlamagne, your mm -hmm. socks match the, the, the hoodie. These are Nipsey Hussle Marathon socks. I love them. Salute the, uh, the you know, marathon clothing. He has right. stylists come in today. And Jasmine Brand, and Jasmine <laughs> from the Jasmine Brand is joining us because Yee is... I'm not uh, just a brand, I'm a Jasmine I'm brand. emotional support for Angela Yee's last day. Yeah, Yee's mm -hmm. a little hurt, so yeah. uh, helping her out this morning. I'm, so, her, I'm her support animal. I'm, de I'm devastated. Y'all gonna need an emotional support dog to get on the plane. She's gonna have to act blind. <laughs> She's she, she, she gonna be on my shoulder. That's what I'm saying. She's gonna have to act blind to get on that flight. All right, it's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. The Breakfast Club. Your mornings will never be the same. Any first responder will tell you, never try to beat a train. After braking, it can take a mile for a train to completely stop. So when you come to a rail crossing, stop. Because trains can't. Paid for by NHTSA. The Breakfast Club. This report is sponsored by Christmas Tree. Power 105.1. The Breakfast Club. Your mornings will never be the same. Any first responder will tell you, never try to beat a train. After braking, it can take a mile for a train to completely stop. So when you come to a rail crossing, stop. Because trains can't. Paid for by NHTSA. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV, Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are The Breakfast Club. Now, we've been joking and saying Yee only has three friends, right? Two, two of them came yesterday. Jasmine's here today. FYI, that's three more friends than you have. You're right. You're right. But then we have another person <laughs> that on the line. I don't know if that's your friend or not, but you say it's your friend all the time. Young lady, hello. Good morning. Good morning. Yee, do you know who that is from that voice right there? No. Nope. See? So you don't really have any friends. Can you give her another clue? <laughs> and you don't know who this is? <laughs> no, I have no idea. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> really? <laughs> We go hard. I know it's Santi. Hi, Santi! Santi! <laughs> now, y'all got my best friend. Now, Sa Aww, Santi, she says, you, she says you're her best friend, but we ain't seen you up here. You, we've been doing the Breakfast Club 13. She lives in L.A. Yeah, and, and you don't have... That's you, not why. Y'all don't, don't ever invite me up there. Plus, I don't want to mix Santi with... Uh, Your the, best friend doesn't invite you up here? Mm -mm -mm. I don't want to mix her with these lower-tier people. <laughs> these lower-tier people. <laughs> I know. Yeah, you can say yeah, Angela Yee lower tier? Because <laughs> you know what she's not. Oh. I know she's not talking about no, me. No, she could be around me. You know what I'm saying? But oh. listen, Santi, and I, I just actually did Santi's podcast that she launched. Yes, she did. She was amazing. You're supposed the to say Global champion. Yes. Look, I'm trying to help Santi. She's not good at promoting herself that well. She loves to work <laughs> and do things, and she's very creative. But um, she also launched a tea company recently, right, Santi? Santi? Yes, it's called Spiritual's Tea. Look at Angela. I'm She's here working to for you. Angela today. I know, but you know what? Our camera guy, Nick, is a huge Santi Gold fan, and he was very upset you didn't call the tea company Santi. Oh my God. I mean, that's like 
<laughs> I've heard that about a thousand times so far. It's he thought he was like so clever. Say, Santi. <laughs> like, Santi Claus. It's like the same type of thing where it's like, okay, thank you. <laughs> so we're talking to Santi Go, which is Angela Yee's bestie, her, ba- her BFF. You got to tell us a story about Angela Yee that oh, we God. don't know, we haven't heard. That's not going to get her in trouble. Oh, God. I know. I was thinking about that before I called in, and I think that's probably why I haven't been up on the show because there's not that many stories I can tell that won't get you in trouble. Uh, in. Um, we had a good time, though. We went to college together. Shout out to Wesley University. We used to live together did. in Brooklyn. I always I say did. I was thinking about this one story in college, though, Anne, that I could right. maybe tell like very vaguely. All right, tell us. Give me a hint. Like, <laughs> We started this like secret oh, group God. that you couldn't you couldn't know the identity, and we had this meeting, and everybody showed up with like, you know, face mask and and, and shower caps and bathrobes, and like so nobody could tell who they were. This sounds sexual. And, you gotta really get to the point. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I don't know how to, how to the point I can get to, except for that <laughs> it got like to this place where Angela got blinded by greed, and we didn't speak for a week because she turned into this like queen pin. Crime boss. <laughs> All right. To be honest, here was the story. Now, I she'll say that. I look at it as I was a hustler. Were you stealing? Robbing? What the hell were y'all doing? No. Santi had this grand idea to start. You can't tell it on the radio. Yes, we can. The statute of limitations is way over. What did y'all do? She had this no, grand Angela, idea. Do it. <laughs> um, she had this grand idea to start a pyramid scheme. And so... <laughs> The way you know how pyramid schemes work, the people at the bottom, they pay $400 to the person on top. It was something like that, right? So and $400 was in line college. Did? So, but it branches off, so it multiplies exponentially, right? So the people, the eight people on the bottom all have to get to the top, but by the time they get to the top, there's eight different pyramids. So then you need 64 people to be paying. Angela, why are you describing how to do a legal business on wow, the radio? Wow, that's why you like crypto so much. That sounds so like crypto. So what ended up happening right was <laughs> that my pyramid was moving really quickly because everybody was trying no, to get because, paid fast because they wanted to it do was it daily. unethical the way that you were doing it, right? Because it was like... We were just getting I paid mean, faster. Like, this sounds a legal activity. Ruined. I'm the, telling you. This is the only fight we ever had was this. Uh, well, but Sa- I just Sa- want to put it out there it that this was long. Santi's idea. Santi, I want you to know I'm in a new series called East New York where I'm very close with the police. So if, He's a snitch. Uh, yes, I, yeah, I might have to snitch on you guys. I just want to put it out there. First of all, this is all a lie and this didn't even really happen. <laughs> <laughs> we did give some people their money back. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Well, Santi, anyway, but anyway, I was very impressed with Angela's like <laughs> ambition at the time. Uh, another thing, you. another thing that you don't know is oh, Angela is like the fastest reader that you've <laughs> ever seen. Did you guys know this about her? Yes, she reads. She when we have, have interviews, seen? a lot of times she reads these books up here, and then she says she did it at home. But I see her start at page two here, so I do. I did know that. Have you ever seen? Have you ever seen that? It's like a, <laughs> I don't know if it's a TikTok or a reel or something where the guy goes on one of those You Got Talent shows and he yeah, plays he, out like fifteen books. <laughs> and he's like, I'm like, I saw that. So I died laughing at that. <laughs> so That's me. That's you though. Yeah. <laughs> Like, how do you retain that information? Well, I'm glad you do exist, and I'm glad you're really her best friend because we've been hearing about you for 13 Aww. years, but you never came up here, which is crazy. She's been the serious when I was on there, and she's going to be on Way Up with Angela Yee. That's right. Okay. Aww. <laughs> well, and so she has a new project Angela. out right now. Santi. What, my record? Yes. What, oh, it's my record? Spirituals, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> can, can, can we play I'm the record now? Out. Yes. All right. Hi, well, Priestess. Introduce the record. Okay, so this is my new song, <laughs> High Priestess, off my album, Spirituals, that is out now. All right. Well, Santi, thank you for checking in and checking in on your friend on her last day of work. So maybe she does know you. Congrats, and I'm so proud of you. Thank you, Santi. I love you. I love you, too. All right. You Bye, love, guys. You don't love us either? No. We love you. She don't know you. But she don't know us like that? All right, fine. All right, <laughs> right Santi. You guys are great. You guys are so much fun. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, thank you, you two thieves. Uh huh. It's the breakfast. Right. And, and I just want to shout out to Santi. See how she's not good at promoting herself, and I have to make her no. talk about what she has no. going on. But um, that's because she's a very humble, creative person. So. All right. But also, you know, when I show up to, to celebrate you, then it's about you. But yeah, I appreciate you, Ange. All right. Well, it's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Yes, thank you, Santi. Hello. Who's this? Hey, what's going on? This is Murph. 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 What up, Murph? What's good? What's going on? Hey, Murph. Today is his last day, on, Murph. Andrew? What's going on, Andrew Lee, man? Congratulations on your new show. Thank uh, you. On your new flow. 
Way up uh, at Angela I Yee. Hey, I, I want to thank you, Yee. You know, I don't know if you remember me, but you let me support my daddy-daughter dance a few weeks back. Oh, yes, you I remember you? that. That was cute. Crazy success. It was great. I got so many people who want to do me uh, who wanted me to do hosting for them. So I appreciate you. Thank you very much. All right. Congratulations, last brother. Thing, last thing I want to say, DJ Envy. Yes, sir. Me and I got a bone to pick with you, bro. Homecoming. You were supposed mm -hmm. to come to Benedict. You didn't give us a shout out. Nothing. Our football team, our football team is the only other HBCU that undefeated. You ain't you ain't holler us out. You ain't shout us out, and you stood us up on homecoming. So you need to shout out Benedict and give us some love at least once. You right. supposed to be at Benedict homecoming? Shout out to Benedict. Oh, yeah, you supposed to be, supposed was, to be our DJ. Yeah, I was supposed to go, but um, we had to cancel because we were shooting a TV show. Well, why show. you couldn't even shout them out? I though. did shout them out. I did the whole video. He be shouting out state. He be shouting out South Carolina State. He, he don't out never shout out South Carolina team. State. I shout out South Carolina State because I, I got an honorary degree from South Carolina State. Live. Oh, you don't man. be listening. I even did a video for Benedict because I couldn't make it. But yeah, we he don't shoot. even like South Carolina State because he got robbed in Orangeburg. <laughs> no, I didn't, I didn't get robbed. I got scammed in Orangeburg. Same, Same difference. No, it was a big okay. difference. No. But yeah, no, we were shooting a show uh, called uh, Road to Homecoming where we you know, went to all the homecomings to try to... It goes on... It's, actually, I'm not sure what network, but they're going to air all the different things about different homecomings different HBCUs. We went to um, St. Augustine's University. We went to FAMU. You can't we back shout out we things went to Hampton. now. We went to, um, went to a bunch of HBCUs. So that's what we were shooting. So, All right. But anyway. Hello, who's this? Perfect. Hello, this is Lola calling from Houston. Peace, what Lola. Lola from hey, Houston. Lola, H-Town. Hey, Angela Yee. I'm so <laughs> sad you're leaving. Girl, I've been calling all morning trying to get through. I was calling, curling my hair, girl. Um, <laughs> you. you finished curling your hair? Huh? You finished curling your hair? Yes, I'm done. I'm getting ready for work. Yes, I had to call and tell you bye. It oh, still look a little okay. crazy in the back, though. Yes, yeah, send us a picture. Okay. We want to repost it. Okay, okay, I'm going to send y'all a picture. The curls is popping. No, girls. no, it look a little crazy in the back. You got one look. Uh, no. Don't listen to somebody without hair. Don't let them talk That's crazy. Right. For real, I say that. Say that. Well, I just wanted to call and wish you all the best. Thank you. And I'm going to be listening to y'all two knuckleheads. But Angela, yes, I'm definitely looking forward to everything that you got coming up, sweetie. Thank you so much. I appreciate I'm it. I'm It's like you're going to get yes. more of The Breakfast Club because we'll be on 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. And Angela, you'll be on 10 a.m. to 2 I know that's right. <laughs> she is so twisted. Hello, who's this? Hi, everybody. How are hey. you guys? Hey, everybody. What's up? <laughs> hey, fam. Hey, fam. <laughs> yes, I'm listening to you from Switzerland. Oh, Switzerland. Okay. okay. What time is it in Switzerland? Uh, it's around 1 p.m. What you listening on, the iHeartRadio app? Yes. Oh, we app. are international. Wow, okay. Yes, well, are. at least you guys are. I'm well, good not afternoon even. to you, sir. I don't believe she's leaving. She's leaving you guys. <laughs> she's not leaving. I mean, she's leaving, but she got her own show called Way Up with Angelique, so you can still listen to her on the iHeartRadio app. She comes on right after The Breakfast Club. I'll be here. Okay. So not really, you know, but I'll be here after here. Being, being a top of the year. Okay. The what of the year? Top. I don't know. Top. top of the year, right? Are you oh, she said, oh she, you said, oh, I thought you said Envy was the top of the year. No, no, this is nothing oh, about me God. being the top of nothing. Oh, okay. That would make you the okay. bottom of the year. Yeah, that would, that would make you bottom. <laughs> no, I'm a power top. <laughs> no, no, I'm the top. Y'all both can't be top. Envy got his own bottoms. Nope. I'm not one of them. Nope. Well, thank you so much, Switzerland. Yeah, I messed up his whole call. Thank you. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> he said, yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. So, we got what you were trying to do. <laughs> so a bunch of people just walked in here. Are they here for Angelique? <laughs> Who are these individuals? He said, mm. he said mm, I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, we got rumors on the way. She yeah, don't know. I thought we just, didn't y'all just do rumors? We do them once an hour, hour Jack. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> we so do them as much you as you, Jasmine, Ray. Okay. 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 What are we talking about? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hold on, hold on. Lord hold help on. us. We'll we have rumors when we come back. We promise. It's Angela Yee's next day. She a little saucy. It's my last day. Last my day. Next day. Sorry, guys. Are you drunk? Yes. Jasmine from Jasmine Brand is here trying to help us out, but there's no help. Doing an awful job. Oh my goodness. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. So right now we have a beautiful, sophisticated black queen on the line. She is so pretty, so gorgeous. One of the fav one of my favorite people in this world. Hello? Hello. Hello. This is uh Angela, do you know who that is? No. All I heard was hello. You don't know who that is? Not from that. We need more clues. We need more okay, all right. She's probably the most inspirational person in your life. 
Your mom. Congratulations. <laughs> she didn't even know who it was. It's your mom. I said, your I'm, mom. I'm, I'm like, totally you kidding. I'm totally kidding. Hi, mommy. Hey, mama Yee. Hi, Ann. Hi. You work. I'm so proud of you, Ann. You oh. work so hard. You're so kind, generous, and compassionate. Um, don't forget to pay me later. Um, <laughs> <laughs> She's so cute. I like, I already, you know. Come on, Ma. Stop. I know, I know. <laughs> and I, I want to say much continued success to you, and I am looking forward to Way Up with Angela Yee. Why do you do that like this? An ad. There you go. It is. Now, Miss Yee. I am looking forward. Now, now you, uh, Mama Yee, was Yee your mo your problem child as a when she was a child, mm -hmm. a kid? Angie was born with a phone at her ear, making deals. She was mm. always busy. There you go. See, I think this theme of entrepreneurship has been ringing. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know she was a scam artist? We found out earlier today that her and her best friend Santi. Would do pyramid schemes in college. We did, did it one time. <clears throat> there is no such, such person such as Santi. <laughs> she knows nothing. See? She knows nothing. And let me tell you something. While Envy was out there getting scammed, okay? Y'all was doing the scamming. We was doing the scamming. <laughs> Who would you rather be? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> All right, well... And my mom's I like, I gotta go. My <laughs> mom's like, all right, all right now. I gotta, I gotta go. I got, I got, I got things to do. I brag about you all the time. Oh. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh. Uh, thank you. I don't know who all the who people, people are. Are you at work, Ma? Yes, I am at work. I'm like you, Ange. Well, shout out to everybody at, at New York City Transit. Woo! Okay. All right, Mama Yee. Thank you for calling in, checking in. Take care. All right, now. Bye. There you have it, Mama Yee. We're taking more phone calls, 800-585-1051. Today is Yee's last day. Call her up, give her her flowers, well wishes, all that. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Hello? Hey, what's up? Good morning. We tried to surprise Yee, but she just walked out the room. She's walking back in. She's a little drunk She's right drunk, now. yo. She's drunk already? Yes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's Ida Rodriguez on the line. Good Ida! 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 Hey, you know, hey, I woke up for you. I wake up for you. What's up? Hi, I, I feel like you'd be up at this time anyway. Yeah, you know, I don't sleep. I have insomnia. But, hey, congratulations. Job well done. Thank you, Ida. Ida is a really good friend of mine. Amazing comedian. Jasmine Brand is here, too. Hey, Ida. Hey, Jasmine. What color is your hair today, Jasmine? It's always pink. Always pink, girl. <laughs> it is? Yeah. Oh. Ida, what's, what part of the world are you in? I'm in, girl, I'm in Los Angeles. Okay, all right, you home. Well, Ida Rodriguez is I'm one home. of my favorite comedians, but one of my favorite people also. So, you know she's... Listen, I'm, so, I'm proud of you. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations, you've done such a great job. You've held it down for women of color in media, and you show up. You be watching people's stuff. You know what? What you be reading people's books. <laughs> they be informed about what you gonna talk to a person about. You should be proud of that. I'm so, I'm so proud of you. I think that um, the next season is going to be phenomenal, and um, I love to hear rumors about you from people who don't know you. They make me laugh because they don't know I know you, and I'll be like. Really? <laughs> really? And what else she did? What rumors you be hearing, Ida? Spill it. Oh, the rumors that I hear about Angela. Oh man, they are, they've been they've been emphatically ridiculous, as uh, Louis Farrakhan would say. <laughs> I've heard some rumors about myself too. You know what's funny? Like, yeah, about, mm -hmm. no, go ahead, go ahead. No, I was gonna say that somebody had did a whole blog post about all these people I slept with and half of them I didn't even know who they was I had to Google them it was like some football players it was a good list though. there was women yeah. on there I was like I've never done that I ain't never seen that blog post I seen it I saw it too <laughs> oh no no I, I've, heard, I've heard those those rumors too I think I've talked to people who read those blog posts because I don't read that kind of stupid shit but <laughs> I will say though because I feel like my brain cells die when I read them like that it's funny when you hear about you know about y'all because you gotta you gotta know y'all to really know. But listen, I, I just I wanted to shit, to shout, rain some positivity on you and just say congratulations, job well done. I look forward to the next season. I know that whatever you touch is going to be phenomenal. And listen, you are responsible <laughs> for the term entanglement. You have never been 
<laughs> if I can get credit for anything, yes, you're right. You're right about that. You know what I'm saying? You you added a new word to the urban dictionary. <laughs> that should have been in that dictionary, like entanglement. That's when you don't want to admit the whole full scope of what it is. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. It's possible for, uh, listen, if yo, listen, according to the streets, is your fault Chris Rock got slapped? No, damn. no. Goodness All right, yeah, I did not. You're not taking too far. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's not my fault. Your legacy is wild, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you Google that, it all traces back. Damn. Goodness gracious. No, nah, that's a joke. Well, all right, all right. thank you for checking out. All right, let Ida, Ida go. Let Ida go. Tell the joke for being a comedian and telling the joke because, you know, uh, the dummies will take that and roll with it. Oh my goodness. Shout out to Ida, man. When we uh, went away from my birthday, we were the only two people who didn't get COVID. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was the. Uh, you, but it was fun, though. Yeah, it was it fun. It was fun. We would have been okay with it. it. Was fun. <laughs> we, we integrated Dave Chappelle's camp. We brought some color <laughs> to that. <laughs> goodness. Well, thank you, Ida. You're welcome. Have a beautiful Peace, day. Peace, Ida. All right, Ida. Bye. Hey, y'all. God bless y'all. Love y'all. Love God bless you. All right. When we come back, we got more calls, and ye will be trying to do the rumors. Keep it locked. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Jasmine. Where's our shots? I ain't want to be with you. What? <laughs> you don't need no more shots. <laughs> no. Okay? You don't need no more shots. Don't Nothing. you got a plane to catch later today? Yes. Right. And guess who has not had no shots? Who? The person that's going to make the flight. And gonna have to stay with her drunk exactly. friend. So what'd you do with gonna the have to shot stay with her drunk friend at the you. airport. They didn't give me a shot. Yes, they did. Okay. You, you when they escort her off the plane. I took a couple. First of all, I just want to say Elvis Duran came down the hall, and when we first started the Breakfast Club, we had shots with Elvis on the rooftop of the Gansevoort. That is a fact. Nice. Yes, yes. that's true. And so I feel like this is fitting. Okay. Full circle. Yes, yeah, a full circle moment. Dropping the clues bombs for the Godfather, Elvis Duran. Can y'all bring you a shot? Bring a one shot? No, 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 man, no, no, no. Stop. Do you want her to make it a flight or not? It has to be everybody. I'm not taking no shot at 8 o'clock. It has to be like everybody. It. <laughs> Why? Because I'm not Ed Sheeran? No. no. I ain't, that was seven years ago. <laughs> that was six years ago. My lifestyle has changed. I'm, not right. Right. Oh, I'm 44 Ooh. years old. To Angela Yee. Yeah, to Angela Yee. nothing Andy, in there. Andy, Andy, Andy is. is not drinking that. That's tequila. It's not tequila? Exactly. Why is he lying? Exactly. <laughs> Why you gotta lie, such bro? a liar. I'm not telling I'm 44 years old. I'm, I'm not taking shots shot. at come 8 o'clock in the shot. morning. Come on. Oh. No shots. Shot, come on. And y'all drove to work, too. It's, it's one shot, Come bro. on. Right. Come on, let's do it. Congratulations. Ooh, Boom. shots and spray. I'm taking a shot Tell and spray. Stop being a bussy. I'm a bussy. <laughs> I'm a big bussy. You're a big bussy? Come on, let's take it. Okay. You gotta say something. You just can't take the shots. Um, what can I say? I don't know. I'm Come on, Ange. Oh, Ange. God. Yeah. Where's my Glorilla drop? That's enough. think about a speech. <laughs> hey, what's up? It's your girl, Glorilla, a.k.a. Big Glow, and it's Angela Yee's last day on a breakfast club. After today, you about to be F-N-F. Let's go! Now she's F-N-F now. Take a shot to that. All right, let's take a shot to that. Okay. Look at that. Envy faking. Look at that. Look at that. Look at You need to grow up, bro. Evan, you are the worst for that. You're 57 years old. You taking shots at 7.59 Evan, do it for real. I'm going to take a shot. Then you tell on me. And then you say, I'm the worst. Let's get to the rumors. We got one minute left. Oh, anybody tell you to fall to peer pressure? Go over there. She's spilling the tea. This is the Rumor Report with Angela Yee on The Breakfast Club. I am going to take a bottle home, though. No, you're not. <laughs> yes, you can't. Sam, you tuck take... me that bottle nope, up. Don't tuck, tuck me that bottle of Don't tuck him nothing. I never had. I never had Lobo, so I want to try it. It's good. Yeah. Yeah, I want to try it. We're enjoying it. Tuck that for me, Simp. Thank it's you, too Atlanta. early to talk. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> LeBron. <laughs> All right, come on. All right. Nia Long. She is talking about uh, Ime Udoka and that whole cheating scandal. And she told The Hollywood Reporter that moving, she's moving forward and she remains optimistic. She said 2023 is like the year of new beginnings for me. I couldn't be more excited. But she also said this whole thing has been devastating for their son, as you can imagine. Mm. It was very public. And sometimes you got to think about how other people feel too and how it affects children that's real all right and tj holmes and amy robach they um apparently completely ignored speculation over their alleged affair while co-hosting gma3 one day after the news broke 
and they just were back on the air as normal yesterday. You know, you still got to work. I respect that. Dude. I yeah. bet the ratings were amazing. I know they yeah, were. Sure and and was like, I like know? that they didn't address it. I like that they just act like, what's, yeah, what's up? Why yeah. should they? Let everybody else talk. That's social media. Let them do their thing. And yeah. you don't confirm nor deny. You just What y'all going to do, do when business? y'all news breaks? <laughs> what news? <laughs> he said, what news? I don't know that's right. Like, you see they about? both in <laughs> unison. They got it planned out. What you talking about? What news? Who did what? Oh, my goodness. Who said that? Who did what? The who? <laughs> well, that is your rumor report. <laughs> Why are you trying to get out of this? Because it's, it's no longer. You spent 10 minutes taking shots. You no longer. Oh, my, oh my gosh. gosh. Man, man, no like, oh, oh, my gosh. Man, that was going to be so funny when Angelique get escorted off that plane. Don't say, <laughs> Jasmine, don't say man, that. Listen, will you report that on Jasmine Brand? I will. <laughs> <laughs> we definitely report it on Monday. I will. Monday. And y'all better report it on Monday. Oh, we definitely report it on Monday. And we got so many listeners that people going to know, uh, aren't you drunk? They might just see you at <laughs> oh the airport God. and be like, oh. I'm not drunk. I only have four shots. This morning. And wow. shout out to Art who works here. He had his first shot ever in life. He's never drank before. He's a liar. Oh you believe he looked thing. like he was about to cry, and he's I'm not joking. Oh but he looked he looked like he was about to he's, cry. He's not. That's and a, this is how I, it I all starts. I said, next thing you know, he. I'm not gonna. Don't no. no let's, let's stop. I highly doubt that. <laughs> Whatever y'all do when y'all wrap it up, let's. <laughs> I highly doubt that was the first shot. And if it wasn't the first shot, why do y'all fall to so much peer pressure? I felt bad for him. There's a cap. <laughs> <laughs> so you're not doing donkey what are we doing we're gonna have people call in for Angela E and I thought Elvis was coming back over he is yeah okay I bet Elvis get you to do a shot I bet you he won't <laughs> I bet you he I will. bet you what he time won't. do you what time is appropriate to take a shot uh after five o'clock oh my gosh it okay. is after five o'clock somewhere mm -mm. No, it's after five o'clock it's eight mm -mm. He meant PM ye. <laughs> PM. Oh my god. And I'm driving too? Hell no. Well, today is Angela Yee's last day. Yep. So uh, she's a little saucy. Uh, we got some special callers. We're going to be taking your phone calls when we come back. So oh, move. and I'm doing a ye mix. Let why them know. are you yelling? Yeah, why are you yelling at us? Because <laughs> she's saucy. Like, and I'm doing Y'all know why she's yelling. Why? Why? Now, if you had to guess what's going to be happening in the ye mix today, what would you guess knowing you? You forgetting to play music because you're drunk? He gonna stand in front of the turntables but forget to press play. <laughs> Yemix! Yemix! Oh my goodness, we'll be back. It's The Breakfast Club, good morning. The Breakfast Club. Your mornings will never be the same. Any first responder will tell you, never try to beat a train. After breaking, it can take a mile for a train to completely stop. So when you come to a rail crossing, stop. Because trains can't. Paid for by NHTSA. Ha! Ha 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 It's the world's most dangerous morning show, The Breakfast Club. What's happening? Now, uh, if you just joined us, today is Angela Yee's last day. Now, That's uh, why I'm not doing donkey today, because uh, we want to spend as much time celebrating Angela Yee as possible, even though she's already four shots in at eight something in the morning. Um, Envy's one shot in. I've drank nothing because I have a family. Well, I was trying to drink water, but you told on me. Well... Stop falling the peer Angelique, pressure. She's too old to fall the peer pressure, She's bro. supposed to be on air right now, but she's outside having outside more shots. Outside celebrating having more shots. So this is what we want to do. 800-585-1051. Phone sex with the Breakfast Club. Oh, my God. Today Why? Because this is what you wants to do. You know she's freaky lip oh, service. Oh, I can't wait to her new show's done. All right. So, <laughs> so this is what you can do. 8 o'clock in the morning. Guys and girls, women and men. Call up right now. Is this really your idea? You? Yes. Or is Envy just putting this no, on? What do you do? Freaky, Freaky, Freaky Friday. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're doing Freaky Friday. See? I know that, but he said something else specifically. Phone sex? See? Okay. All right. Phone sex with the Breakfast Club. Stop so screaming. I know there's a lot of people that heard that we have an amazing power bottom and an amazing power top. So if you guys want to call and have phone sex with the Breakfast Club, now is the time. Where is all this coming from? <laughs> What's in that goddamn alcohol? Man? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what is, what is, I'm a clear these lines. What right is now? Now? being He's spread this morning? Right is it because the Jasmine brand is in? Because Jasmine, like, what is I'm this? I'm brand. Y'all not going to blame brand. me now. Phone sex with the Breakfast Club. 800 585 1051. If you want to have phone sex with anybody up here, including Jasmine, you what? Can call us yes, right wait, Jasmine. A, wait a minute. Wait a minute now. Jasmine, stop. Don't you, act like that. You part of this. Okay. She said, stop. <laughs> you you part of this, Okay. Okay. If I you want to know who the top and bottom is. Who you think is the power top and power bottom? You're, you're definitely yeah, the yeah. bottom. That definitely. is not true. You're bottom. You seem like you throw it back Bruh, and pictures. Ain't no. <laughs> what, what, man, damn, I got Joey in here. <laughs> we don't got no gay energy in here to come in here and tell <laughs> the streets 
who they know the real power Plus, top you is. Up, you say you say you're a power top. Uh, absolutely, okay. I would be a power top. Envy, nothing about you're a power top as well. He's not a power top. I don't know. Envy might be the power bottom. He keeps getting scammed. There you go. What? That's right. Because not only did he get scammed in South Carolina, but he told us another story about how his his bike got stolen. That's right. Damn, Envy. Does he like being on his stomach? And then remember they told you them fake leather jackets. They did. You get scammed all the time. I thought power tops were like more of a weight thing. No, a height thing. Yes. So who has the bigger bunkie? No, I ain't never heard that now. Power topping got nothing to do with height. What does it have to do with like being like strong or like I thought it was the energy. I thought it was like, you know Oh like like big D confident energy. the more confident you are, the more of huh? the chances that you are like, I feel like he has bigger hips, right? So he would be. I'm definitely thinking. Are we, you we hippie? Know this. He's I'm arch. not hippie. I'm just so he's, thick. He's more arch. I'm just okay, thick. there you go. Everybody in here jealous okay. of my okay. shape. Okay. I know archy. that's right. Everybody. He would, yeah, he would be a bottom. That's it. He's a bottom. I'm not call traffic. Well, why are you why are you saying he would be a bottom? Because because the reason he's so thick is because you know how they say them back back shots get yeah. your butt bigger. That's how he got. That, is, that is not. Okay. It's too early I'm, for this. I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna I'm, lie. I'm 41, 36, 43, all because of uh, working out and eating right. Okay. You really know your measurements. Yes, he I does. do. I don't know. Do you know yours? Mm-mm. Only a power bottom. Envy. Do you doctor. know your measurements? Okay, Benita Applebaum. What's the point of knowing your measurements when you ain't got nothing? Apple What's, the point in your What's the point of knowing your measurements when you ain't got nothing? <laughs> don't hate, don't hate on us thick ones, all right? These thick ones. Okay. The, the hate for the thick ones is Tell real. Tell him, no surgery or nothing. Taylor, you know your measurements, right? That's right. <laughs> is, oh, wait a minute. So, no, so it's just because I'm not thick, I don't know my measurements? Yes. No. Charlamagne had a BBL. <laughs> Your measurements are letters. S M L. That's all you need to know. Oh, all right. 800 585 1051. Phone sex with The Breakfast Club. Call us up right now. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. The Breakfast Club. Yeah. Morning, everybody. It's DJ Envy, Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are The Breakfast Club. Shout out to DJ Louis V, who's doing shots at home with us. My guy, Louis V. <laughs> Now, um, this is phone sex with the Breakfast Club, where you can call and have. Well, phone- first of all, it's Friday, so you know what that means. It's, it's freaky, 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 freaky Friday. Friday. And we had a quarter of a shot, and he is lit. I would say this is Angela Yee's final Freaky Friday, but it knowing is. her way up with Angela Yee will be Freaky Monday, Freaky Tuesday, Freaky Wednesday, Freaky Thursday, yes. Freaky Friday, and Freaky on the Lip Service Podcast. There we you go. get it in, baby. <laughs> well, let's let's start it off. Uh, we're doing phone sex with the <laughs> Breakfast Club. This is what Angela Yee wants for her last day, by the way. <laughs> I do. I asked for it. Hello? Sorry. I asked for it. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. What's your oh. name? What's going on? Because I'm trying to... Look, Angela Yee, I'm taking, I'm taking a shot for you too, bro. Let's do it. What you taking a shot of? You calling from Brooklyn or Harlem? Early in the morning, honey. Let's go. You calling from Brooklyn or Harlem, right? Where you from? I'm from, I'm from Stanford. I'm from Connecticut. Oh, Stanford. Okay. Okay. Connecticut. Yep. Now, do you prefer women or men? Come on now. I prefer men. Men, okay. Why you say come on now, Charlamagne? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I was stereotyping. I heard a voice. <laughs> he said, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I thought so too. I ain't gonna lie. I heard yeah. a voice. I thought she was. Who do you want to have phone sex with? I'm trying to have phone sex with Charlamagne. Okay. Like it's not my last day. We the envy. You are definitely a bottom. I mean, you might oh be a verse God. bottom, but you not gonna be. Ain't no top. What's up? Oh, oh, you said I'm the top, right? No, Charlamagne definitely is. I mean, he a little top. But That's right. Oh, a little he top. A top. That right. would be a good rapping name for you, Lil Top. Lil Top. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so a good DJ name, too. DJ Lil Top. So, so, so Brad, how your phone sex with Charlamagne, man? Lil Top. Lil Top. Lil Top. Lil Top. I mean, <laughs> Envy, oh my gosh. You just hate, now you hating on her. Now not, you mad. I'm sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. I mean, don't be, I mean, DJ Envy, why are you so mad? I mean, you got uh, all this energy. I'm not in this. You messing up the phone sex. Can we get to it? Ooh. Get to it. Thug out. Thug him out. Thug out Charlemagne. Thug out Charlemagne. Charlemagne, I mean, I could just see you over there with your chocolate ball head. I'm going to just rub some (laughs) oil on it and just let you go deep in. I mean, I mean, just want you to just go and slide in. But you know what? You got to be protected first. I know that's right. Let's talk about sex, baby. I'm married, man. And I I ain't no power about him. I'm going to let you talk me because you little. And I know Ooh. you about Now hold on, like, I need to ask a question. Do you <laughs> identify as a woman? Are you like I'm like what is going on here? Like what is happening? I'm so confused right now. Why? What do you mean? No, never mind. It's Thank just, you. You have a good one. Admit, that, yeah, was that was good. Little <laughs> top. Hello, who's this? She like she got burst fluidity, gender. <laughs> Who you want to have phone sex with? Angela Yee, of course. All right, go ahead. Of course. It's her last day, make it good. <laughs> All right. 
No, not really, though. Um, I just wanted to give her a full hour, man. Boo. Boo. Get bummed out. Boo. You can still let him talk, though, Andy. God damn. Whatever oh, happens, yes. Jasmine is doing it, too. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap. Don't get scared now. You want to have phone sex with oh, me? I, I ain't, oh, I ain't never scared. Charlemagne, go. No, no, not Charlemagne. Angelique, don't do that. Okay, my bad. Go ahead, go. I want to put a hickey on Angelique. I hate that. You want to do what? Ooh. That hurts. Now, we just yeah. talked about this. You cannot Oh, my God. Do that. Why, why, why can't I? This is no foreplay. You just diving right no, in. No, but also because nobody wants that suck that hard. You got to. No, not for a hickey, it would be. Bro, it's no foreplay. You just going straight to the. to the. No chicken. Now, we don't have a problem Chick-fil-A. going straight no, no, there. No, no, but you got to be gentle. You can't play with her little pretty ass. You got to be gentle. That's all you, that's all you got, bro? Yeah, that's all. I guess too early for that, y'all. Okay. Hello, who's this? Oh, good morning, Breakfast Club. Ah! I, th- I like the way this is going. <laughs> you yeah, like this already, that. Envy? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like you want Charlemagne. Come Envy on, Envy's right there. He's crazy. right there. He's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> crazy. I'm not going to lie. I've been waiting for Envy. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Let's go, bro. Let's do it. No, let's go. Talk let's to me. Let's do it. I'm coaching you on now. Envy been waiting for you, too. Go. Go. Now, Tell us Envy. more. The floor is yours. Envy. Tell me, tell me what you're wearing right now, Envy. He's got on a black hoodie. Oh, no, go ahead. He's had on the same him. clothes for three days. Tell him what you're wearing. What you wearing. Tell him what you're wearing. Everybody be, everybody be quiet. I'm talking to Envy. Okay, okay. I'm wearing Envy. jeans, Air Force Ones, and socks. He's and wearing nothing but a Carcella oh, chain. shirtless. What color drawers are you wearing, Envy? Red. Are, are, are those same weird, the same red drawers you wear all the time? That's right. For 13 years straight, baby. He got, you know you know him. It's red, His so red you drawers don't even is like see the blood. blue vest. He ain't taking it off. Take those drawers off and tell me what they smell like right now. <gasps> Charlamagne? You don't want to know. He said, what? <laughs> what does it smell like, Charlamagne? Yeah, what, no what, you, what you gonna do to Envy? Oh, my goodness. Envy, I know they smell vicious. <laughs> 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 I ain't playing with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying, love, Trav, like, Trav, can I ask you a serious like, question? Trav, but seriously, call me later. <laughs> Trav, <laughs> who's the power top? Who's the bottom in this situation? Come on now, be honest. So I tell you all the time, I love you, but you a bottom. You a bottom. Oh, you a bottom. Oh, oh, my that, didn't go how, that didn't go how you wanted it. That don't, mean, that don't mean envy a top. Oh, oh yeah, is envy a top? <laughs> Envy giving verse top. Okay. Ooh, verse top, okay. Verse you, top. you can do, you you can do, do both. You can top, do top or bottom. You got a pancake. You just you flip it. You can you want it. Goodbye, Trash. Flip it. Front, back. 5851151. This is uh, what was that? I think it's over, Emmy. What? Emmy was just juggling some word up. Go Nad. Go Nad. This guy is crazy. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV Angeline, Charlemagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Now, this is phone sex with the Breakfast Club. We got another special person on the line. Who do you want to have phone sex with, sir? Who are you talking to, me? Oh. oh, who are you talking to? Who is this? <laughs> who would you prefer, NV or mean, Charlemagne? I mean, I'm gonna, I'm. What obviously would have to be Ange, but I, we can't do that because that's like my sister, so that that will never happen. G Smith, ladies and gentlemen, G Smith. What up, G? My guy, G Spin, man. G Spin put the Breakfast Club together. G Spin, G Spin, G Spin, and, and 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 our guy Cadillac Jack, man, put the Breakfast Club together, man. That is a fact. You yes. guys are still still up there causing trouble. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Where are you at, G Spin? Uh, I'm just up running around doing adult things. Okay. Adult oh. Things today, trying to just get get some uh, get some things done early in the morning, but I had to call in and just say how proud I am of all of you, but especially you, Ange and. I'm so happy for obviously what what this has become and for the next chapter in your life. And, you know, what a lot of people don't know is, you know, you are actually the first one uh, that I that I tried to bring over to power. Mm -hmm. And um, and I remember the phone call. Angela was actually on her way to Philadelphia, getting on a train uh, to go possibly take another radio gig. And I remember begging you not to get on the train. Mm -hmm. I said, do not go. I promise you something's going to happen here. Right. Yeah, and it did. And I had to turn down that job in Philly to wait for this job That's in New right. York. That's right. And it all came together, and it's pr- pretty amazing. So I'm super happy for you and 
looking forward to the next chapter as well. I think we did all right, right, G? I think we did all right, huh? Uh, it's, a, it's, it's amazing, man. There like, was a lot of haters, a, a lot of doubters. Now, G, stay with us, well, though. Appreciate you, G. Yeah, I mean, you know, it, it's funny. It's like everybody thinks it was an instant success looking back. And, you know, there was obviously that time when, you know, we first got you guys on the air. That first six months, it was, you know, it was a little scary, right? Like, we, didn't, we had no idea, obviously, if it would even work, let alone be what it is today. Um, but, you know, I, I think, you know, the, the grind that you guys showed and, you know, the other thing is you guys were such early adapters on the social media and were kind of so prevalent in the in the in the virtual you know world of the Internet that, you know, the perception was that we were kind of doing a lot better than maybe we were at the time. That's right. And then just to see everything come together and, and work. And, you know, it's it's so amazing what I've you know, what's happened in the past. Scott, what is it now? Eleven years? It'll be, no, 13. It, it'll be 13, 13 years. today. 13 yeah. today. Jason, you, oh, oh. you got to do a shot. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm driving currently, and oh no, don't. Okay, I'll don't do it. Till, but I'll, when I'll, when I'll you I get back to where I am, when you get yeah, to where you're going, going and you're settled in, yes. you got to do a shot. And, and G, I, I, absolutely. Well, go ahead, Evie. What I just want to say, we appreciate you. We and, love um, you, brother. My son asked, "Can you have Drake tickets?" <laughs> Uh, all right, time to go. I see that. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of, love you, a lot of love people you, want them brother. Drake tickets, G Spin. Show how much you care. Uh, uh, Listen, man, I love you guys. And, uh, <laughs> super proud of you and Edge. Like, I can't, I can't wait to hear the new show. And and obviously, I'll be tuning in. One of your biggest fans, so I can't wait, guys. Why don't Thank you come you, back, Jason. G? I, I'm getting off the phone now. <laughs> what you <Yeah>. mean? <laughs> Why don't you come back, He's man? He's happy over there. <laughs> we love you, G. <laughs> Enjoy the day, man. Love y'all, Pete. Uh, All right. He's like, why did I call? Why did I call? He called yeah. her in the wrong segment. There's one more person. Gentleman's name is Evan. Evan, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I'm going to be a little more calm now because my bae hung up on me, and I was a little upset about that. Who hung up on you? Well, we're doing phone sex, and somebody hung up on you. Who do you want to have phone sex with, sir? It's, it's me again. I, look, I thought the phone sex was still the same. Really? I thought I, was, was, my, was my time over? The, the, the oh, oil? Who is Why this? Why is it kind of... Is this the oil? Is this the oil? oil? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> this baby oil. I oh. thought that because I was like, yeah, he just hung up on me like that. Why did oh, you Oh, you wanted that? more Charlemagne. Yeah, that it is. She didn't say... Ba they didn't say... Titty oil. They say they say oh, baby, baby oil. oil. We oh. thought you said titty oil. Yeah, baby oil. Okay, sorry. So what would you do with that? Come on, come on. You gotta get. Come on, you go to it. You sound different. You ain't got like three minutes. Go. You definitely sound different. You sound less manly. <laughs> you sound disappointed. <laughs> no, she did. It's like your voice. You, you sound <laughs> less manly. Huh? You're a man. That's what I said. She said she was a. I don't. I never. I don't know what's going on in 2022. They no said. More, man. I, they, exactly. And I'm calling for Amber, and I'm having sex with Charlamagne. Okay. So go ahead. We're here boy, for it. So now, what, what would you do? Charlemagne's in the bed naked. Go. And and I'm going to rub that baby oil on his bald ass head mm. down the crack of his spine. Oh. Wow, the crack That's of his spine. spine. And I'm going to massage that beautiful black dark skin chocolate back. Mm. Mm. Right. Cool enough, right there in the middle of the spine, right there before I get to the butt cheeks. Mm. I'm going to just go ahead and just massage it softly mm. and just rub it in. While I'm kissing on his neck slowly. Okay. He's mm. touching his face. Then what happens? I'm not touching my face. <laughs> <laughs> look at his. Look How's at that him. Feel, he loves yeah. it. I'm, gonna I'm turn, not entertaining I'm gonna this. Around. I'm going to turn him around and then I'm going to rub that beautiful chocolate chest. Ooh, Ooh. he's right there. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm a rub well chocolate chest, and I mean, he's rubbing. right there. When, when, do, when do we get into the good part? When do we when do we get into the good part? What do you say, going? So what are these parts? <laughs> 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 you know, his, his left nipples was funky. Look, he already now. Wow. I am not, <laughs> bro. I, I like see this. his nipple poking through his hoodie. Trust me, <laughs> ain't nothing hard going on over him. Okay. <laughs> Hey, why are you trying to act people? extra limp? <laughs> I am. <laughs> this is me right now. Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Let Evan talk. Evan, come on. I'm sorry. Go ahead. On, Evan, the, 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 the left Evan, nipple is him. hard. Flip him. Bro, I am not a bottom. That? Even in your wildest dreams, I am not a bottom. Uh-huh. You're top. No, your energy is a bottom. We already made that clear. Oh, so I'm the top. Yeah, no, you're the top. Okay, That's continue. <laughs> oh, my God. So, so he's pounding you right now. Continue. Yep. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yep. Have a nice day, man. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> then we're going we to loop me up so you can get ready to go ahead and put that ICK right where it belongs. Ooh. Ooh. In this nice, tight, wet. Oh, <laughs> my God. 
Evan, hold on, he's getting too hot, Evan. Ain't oh nobody had gosh. no cinnamon toast crunch yet. Evan, yeah. Ain't nobody <laughs> ate no lucky charms. All I know is if Charlamagne go to the bathroom. Nobody right now. had no fish and grits, nothing. That Eddie, was heavy. You clean this one up, Eddie. <laughs> that was heavy. Eddie, Eddie, wait, four. you gotta clean Envy up. <laughs> Eddie, it's a, yeah, Eddie, <laughs> did you just say it's a clean up on aisle four? That's <laughs> a clean up on aisle four. Envy but, said, Envy, he <laughs> told Eddie to clean him up. Red, is there a mess over there? Envy messed on himself. Oh my gosh, it's so inappropriate. You see any ranch salad dressing over there on the floor? <laughs> right. Oh my gosh. Right. Are there any fries? This is ridiculous. <laughs> All right, it's the Breakfast Club. Good morning, Rooms on the Rain. He said clean up on our floor. <laughs> this guy is crazy. Morning, everybody. It's DJ Envy, Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Angela Yee doesn't want to do any rumors. She Dang. wants to go take some more shots. So instead of doing rumors, we got one more last caller that wanted to call and, and share some love. Hello? What's your, what, what's your name, ma'am? Uh, We're doing phone sex with the Breakfast Club. Who would you like to have phone sex with? <laughs> Hello? She's looking at the phone like, did I call the right place? Natari! <laughs> yes? We're just joking! <laughs> <laughs> She, the you definitely looked at the phone like, wait, that's not the right number. She like, wait a minute, I didn't sign up for this. I'm so confused. I want to have phone sex with Angela Yee. Natari, <laughs> hey, boo. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Sorry I couldn't be there getting over this little cold. Okay. How's my little girl? How's Zuri? Oh, she, she's amazing. We're all good. My hubby, my Has daughter. two. We're Yes, he's awesome. We're going to miss you. Well, so listen. Way up. I'm so proud of you. Yes, way up for Angela Yee is on the way. This is my girl, Notori, yes. who, by the way, is a Brooklyn resident now. Is it safe to say you That's are right. You are a Brooklyn person? Yes, I love Brooklyn. I'm enjoying it. Mm -hmm. We're neighbors. <laughs> But yeah, okay. Well, listen, we're going to celebrate in real life when you get over this cold. You know this is my last day on The Breakfast Club. Way Up With Angela Yee doesn't start until the middle of January, so we got some time, girl. Oh, yeah. So we, we need to go out, out, and turn up. You always, Angela Yee is the person to take you wherever <laughs> for good food, good Caribbean food, good drinks. <laughs> you know, the girl catered yesterday. And let me tell you something about Natori. By the time we finally get her to come out, she will be out all night. I know that's okay. Right. The sun be coming oh, up. Yeah, yeah. When so. I step out, it's, it's it's not a game. It's a real step <laughs> out. <laughs> it's a real step out because I don't get many of them. <laughs> all right, well, no, but that's good. You working, girl, and I appreciate you so much. Oh, uh, thank you. I appreciate you, and I'm so proud of you. I'm so excited. Thank you. All right, Natori. Peace, Natori. Thank you. I love that my real friends are calling in today, and even my mama. Even your mama. It's time for the mix, she. <laughs> oh, yee mix, yee mix time! It's time yee for the yee mix. mix. It's time for the yee mix. Now, y'all know that I am a huge, huge fan and supporter of Dance Hall, of Soka. Yep. So, we don't really play that up here. I feel like it's going to be dead air for at least 30 seconds. But then, no, then, no. at least then you're gonna hear a song. You hear you gonna hear dead air for 15 seconds, then you hear ba bum bum bum. <laughs> but I put together this amazing ye mix. You know, I try to make it so everybody could party and dance with us. It's like a carnival. So if you in your car, turn it up. If you at home, get ready to party and dance with us. Jasmine knows. Because when she was pregnant, she came to Angela Yee Day. I did. But all the dance hall artists and the baby came early due to that. I had a time. Yeah. Goodness gracious. All right. <laughs> I had a time. Let's get into the mix now. Her baby's name is actually Soka. Is it? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> no I'm like, what? <laughs> she said stuff with a straight face. That's it was confusing. Does, right? I'm actually. thinking, like, is, it, is that my baby's <laughs> name? <laughs> <laughs> well, let's get into the mix. Uh, Pain in the Ass. Shout out to Pain in the Ass. You probably know from the classic Jay-Z albums. Mm -hmm. Okay, I really Hey, Pain in the Ass. Yeah, so he actually did a, a drop for Angela Yee. That's how we're going to start the mix off. If you remember this classic Jay-Z album, you remember this classic drop. And uh, this is the Yee Mix. The Breakfast Club. Your mornings will never be the same. Any first responder will tell you, never try to beat a train. After breaking, it can take a mile for a train to completely stop. So when you come to a rail crossing, stop. Because trains can't. Paid for by NHTSA. Morning, everybody. It's DJ MV Angela Yee. What the hell is that? <laughs> Hello. Yeah, hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Is this the gentleman that brought all the chairs for the breakfast club? Jeff! <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
What are y'all talking about? Who is it? You know damn well who it is. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Mr. Hart? Kevin Hart, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. What's going on, guys? Good morning. I want to talk to y'all. Where Hi, is that? Hi, Kevin. <laughs> and this is a sad day. It's a sad day, and It's an amazing okay. day, Kevin. No, no, it's a sad day, <laughs> Ange, because radio, that show, is losing one of the best to ever do it. Yes, the announcement has been for so long, but the time is like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, Ange, yes, you, you've had us on the edge for six months of your departure. It's one of the weirdest things <laughs> I've ever seen in my life. Okay. Like somebody... It's when somebody says they quit the job, but then they stay in the break room for three days. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen. <laughs> this is for real the last day, though. It's over for me. You know what? You know what, Ange, on a, on a serious note, I, uh, I'm i like, I'm, I'm torn, right? Because I know this is a big deal. It's a big deal for you, for you to make this step. There's something amazing on the other side. Um, but you, you, you helped make history. The Breakfast Club is an amazing, is an amazing platform for our culture, uh, and it's something that exists and stands in the position it stands because of your involvement, your input. That chemistry that the three of you not only have but have built over the years is special. And I've watched you guys grow. You've helped me grow over the course of time. So I think it's important to give you your flowers and make you understand just how important the radio you are. And I hope that this next step. It's even bigger than this step was for you. I know that you're going to be dope. I know that people are going to follow and, and support you because you've earned that. You you deserve that. But I'd be damned <laughs> if I should just not make you aware and feel how dope you've been throughout the course of this career on The Breakfast Club. And, uh, you know, Charlemagne and, and DJ Envy, I'll be honest with you, they, you, you, you basically made the show. Those two son of a bitches <laughs> own you. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Kevin. And um, I do need some chairs for when we move to the new studio. You got them. You got yes. Em. No, she means from you, Kev. <laughs> she means from you. What do you mean? From yes. you. I'm sitting in chairs. And they got to go a little higher. The, the, the chairs got to go a little higher, Don't Kev. worry about my chairs, okay? I'm going to work this out with Wayne. <laughs> Is you, no, I'm going to do it. I'm sitting them. You'll have these chairs within two months. <laughs> Custom. Just in case. Just in case today is not your real last day. No. <laughs> this is it. We're going to get these Chanel chairs. I'm going to get a Chanel chair, a oh Versace boy. chair. We're going to get a Gucci chair. You tell me what you want. And you tell me the chairs you want. I promise you, you got chairs. Done. Yeah. Once again, I do not break my promises. You tell me you want that. It's done. It's sync. I promise you on everything. Hand on it. I got you. You Get do up. you you do gotta step it up though, Kev, because you know when you bought these chairs, <laughs> you know, you was rich, but now you're you're generational wealthy. Hey, Sean man, you can mind your goddamn chairs. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all worry about your own chairs, okay? <laughs> yeah, yes. We're in we're in detrimental times, so you'd be making these type of announcements. <laughs> 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 The storm ain't over. Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, we got some. Oh, 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 special oh, we delivery, got some Carmino. Right okay. on time. Oh, we got the, that, that Grand Carmino just came oh. in. Oh. That Grand Carmino I just special, came in. Kevin. Mine is special. You damn right, Ange. Open that up. That's for you. Wow. Not a big moment. A big moment. I'm going to talk about gifts. Like, I ain't going to have a gift on deck for you, Ange. Look what I got for you. <laughs> yeah. I ain't going to lie. He got me the special Carmino. I'm not going to lie. Nah, this it's was amazing. this was amazing no, time. Amazing. Not this me. presentation is incredible, Kev. Thanks, Kev. It's, it's definitely a one-of-one. One one one. You'll never see it. Oh, oh my God. Oh. Thank you so much, Kevin. You'll never see it. Oh, wow. it's a grand Carmino. That's okay. for you to celebrate. That's for you to celebrate your hard work. Uh, as you know, this is not an opportunity for a plug because it's not about me. But hard work does take different. That's and right. If you are going to do hard work, celebrate your journey correctly, and that's what Grand Core means. This is not a plug. And I'm not used this opportunity to plug my security. No, it, you're right. Plug. Hard work tastes different, Kev. You're right. It does. It does. So celebrate your journey correctly. And that's what it tastes the Grand Core mean on. Because it doesn't get smoother on All right? No, this is really dope. It's it's custom. It has all my, you know, morning after with Angela Yee. That was my first ever radio show. 
iHeartRadio Urban Personality of the Year Award, Outstanding <laughs> On Air Broadcast Personality, Lip Service, Juices for Life, My Book Club, and they ended it with much more. Wow. <laughs> That's dope. You know what? You know what that is? First of all, what do you mean they ended it? I own it. I did that. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Hart ended it and much more. Y'all, listen, I like seeing all these brothers owning uh, tequila companies. It's amazing. And tequila is my favorite drink. Like, that is my drink of choice, there's tequila room, and mezcal. So. There's room for us all. There's room for us all. I'm proud of my brothers over there uh, and all the success that they're having with Lobo. Uh, I'm proud of my guy, DJ, and all the success he's having with Terra Mana. I mean, there's enough room out here for all to succeed and for everybody to enjoy. So you already know I've never been an anchor. I'm one to do nothing but support mm -hmm. and elevate. In this situation in time, it's about you, Ange, and that stuff on the bottle that I listed, that's the past level of accomplishment, but you should add more. It's going to be more things. I got to get more bottles because you're about to do more sh Point black. Ooh, that's all I right. Big right. black ownership right. talk. Big black ownership talk. Kevin, thank you for Kevin checking black. in, brother. Thank you, Kevin. This is amazing. I, I appreciate you. Love you more, brother. I appreciate you. I love y'all, man. Uh, Envy, Charlemagne, call me once she leaves so we can discuss my position. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we will. Got gotcha. you. <laughs> All right. All right, Kev. <laughs> All right, we, we got the positive note next. It's the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Morning, everybody. It's DJ Envy, Angela Yee, Charlemagne the guy. We are the Breakfast Club. Today is Yeezy's last day. She's out there uh, still drinking. Yeah, she's out there celebrating as she should. Uh, as I said earlier, man, job well done. Mm -hmm. You know, it'll be 13 years of the Breakfast Club uh, this coming Tuesday. What's what date? What's the What's that date? What's the day? The second? So third, fourth, fifth, December fifth. Is it? That's six. Six. December sixth. 13 years ago, uh, on December sixth is when the Breakfast Club launched. So you know, change is good, man. Change is good, and it's inevitable if you've been doing something this long. Absolutely. If you've been doing something this long and it's not changing, it's not evolving, it's not growing, then you know, uh, I would say you're not doing it right. Absolutely. So, yeah. And listen, man, I want to salute to everybody who tuned into my late night talk show last night. Hell of a week. Man, we had a great show last night. Uh, the panel consisted of Trayvon Free, um, Oscar winner Trayvon Free. Mm -hmm. We had uh, Congresswoman Val Demings on last night and the good sister Amanda Seals. And my guy Little Rel was my one-on-one -on -one conversation, man. So if you didn't get an opportunity to check it out in real time on Comedy Central last night at 1130, make sure you stream us on Paramount Plus all weekend long, okay? All weekend long on Paramount Plus. You can stream my late night talk show, hell of a week. Uh, and thank you for everybody who watched last night. All right. All right, when we come back, we got the positive note, and um, Angela, you be out. All right, it's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Damn. Morning, everybody. It's DJ Envy, Angela Yee, Charlamagne the Guy. We are The Breakfast Club. Today is Angela Yee's last day. Yee, you got any shout-outs, anything you want to say to the people before you get up out of here? Well, really, most importantly, like shout-out to all the listeners who've been rocking with us for 13 years now. You know, The Breakfast Club is still here, and I know it's going to be really fun, whatever the evolution is. Whoever y'all put on, I know that's going to be a whole experience, and then I'll be on right after The Breakfast Club, way up with Angela Yee, so make sure you show some support for that. But I'm partying until then, so, you know, look out for that. I'm excited, though, and I know we're all excited for new things, so. And what are you doing for the holidays? I don't even know yet. Jasmine's birthday is on Monday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to travel. Yeah, so we're going to go somewhere and do something. But other than that, I'm going to be working. You know, I still have my coffee shop. Shout out to Coffee Uplift people. If you want to support, go and get some of that. We sell it at Whole Foods. You can go online, coffeeupliftspeople.com. You're not going on vacation? I thought you were going on vacation. We are. Uh -huh. But I said other than that, I'll be working. Okay. On my new show, and I got my businesses, so I'll be here. All right. I do want to just say, you know, Angela Yee, job well done. <coughs> you know what I mean? Job well done. They can never take away, you know, what we built. You know, we've all made history together as a radio show in the Radio Hall of Fame. We are linked together forever, you know, and, and us three have created a, a blueprint for a lot of people to follow, and I just thank God for bringing us together, and I thank God for the last 13 years, and I can't wait to see what God has, you know, planned for us next, and I know that it's going to be incredible, and I know you're going to have tremendous success with uh, Way Up with Angela Yee, and I just think it's fantastic that we built something that can, you know, spawn other things. 
So when we first job started, well they, done, Angela. They tried to say it wasn't going to work. They did. I never said that. No, but other people did. I believed from the beginning. <laughs> people Y'all told to me say, I was corny because I wanted to have Nicki Minaj. Uh, what was that song? Moment, Moment for, for Life. life. For life. In yeah. this moment, we'll be syndicated. Yes. Because I knew we would be. No, I, I think it's right. how you was dancing to it. <laughs> oh, I think so, too. <laughs> yeah, I was, I, I'm just going to say that, you know, we're going to miss, I'm going to miss my sister. Um, I'm not going to miss you taking stabs at me. Aww. every time, But I'm going to miss my sister. Um, who's going to protect you? <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, who's going to protect you? You don't wear me? protection. <laughs> what oh my. are you talking about? Uh, well, y'all got to be more careful. <laughs> I just... <laughs> I just remember the first days up here of me eating Sour Patch Kids and Pepsi oh, and my breakfast and oh. you know us changing the diet and I just want to say we love us you. changing the diet. No, y'all had six shots this morning. Diet. Y'all I had, did. Y'all had Envy six shots eat... this morning in the grill, Jamaican food yesterday for breakfast. Yeah, that's a rare thing. But Envy used to eat two donuts and drink soda every morning. I did, and, and I was like, changed, you got to stop doing that. We changed the diet, and then we got one more person on the line that that wanted to holler at you. The most important person. Oh, God. N-O-R-E. Good morning, Nori. 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 Nori should be up here this morning. Nori, Angela had five shots already. She had five shots? Oh, my God. You missing oh, it, man. Nori. Yeah. I remember oh, when man. Nori first became media and we was at the bar. We was at Prime 112 doing shots to you being woo. media. <laughs> Woo, woo, well, oh, we, hold on, we can take it back farther than that. Nori we used to come up to the breakfast club every Easter. Remember, yeah, every, every Easter, Easter was Nor Easter. 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 <laughs> and people Nor people Easter. fell in love with Nori's storytelling, even though we always knew Nori was a great storyteller. But hearing him, you know, actually do those interviews and have those conversations is what kind of <laughs> like got people like, man, I would like to hear Nori on a regular basis. That's right. But you know what? What they're trying to say, folks, is the breakfast club put me on. That's what no, to say. no, no, <laughs> no, Nori, no. Nori, nobody <laughs> said, but Nori does always listen to us and give us props, so we appreciate that, just like yeah. we always listen to you and give you props. Even when I was at yeah. Sirius, Nori used to come up all the time. Remember you, me, you, Patrice O'Neal? Oh, yeah, man. God bless the dad. Well, rest in peace. Yo, yo, I remember when Nori had me host. I was unemployed at home in South Carolina, and Nori had me host (laughs) his Super Thug mixtape. And he tweeted, he tweeted, you know I'm always on what's next. He was like, I didn't put Juvenile on my album. I put... Little Wayne, he said, that's why I got Charlamagne hosting my mix. Nice. <laughs> did he charge you, Nori? I put MB on, too. I put MB on, too. He did, he did. Come on, yeah. come on. Yep. Come on, come he on. Definitely, you know, he definitely let, did. Let, let, let's let it be about Angela today. That's right. You know, we, we're going to miss you. We're going to miss you. Even though you're going to be right down the block. You know yeah, I'll be you're right there. You still getting that holy moly Nori guacamole. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, uh, so I want to wish you the best. I want to wish the Breakfast Club. You know, you guys, you, you guys have broke ground. You guys have made history. There will never be another Breakfast Club. I want to give y'all y'all flowers, and I, I especially want to give it to you, um, ye, because you, you know, you be my sister throughout this whole thing, and I love you, and and continue to have your success. To all trail, y'all. To all trail, y'all. Uh, <laughs> we love you, Nori. Nori, we need another running competition while I'm on break. Oh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm in one right now. I'm in one right now. Why you ain't call me? We won last time. Yeah, but this, this, I'm, I'm invited to someone else's challenge. But let's start one. Start one tomorrow. I'm in. I'm, I'm, I'm oh drinking coffee and drinking water. Now, Nori. You know what I mean? Drink coffee. Yeah. Today is the, it's the last break right now. I think you should end with an N-O-R-E prayer. Okay, yo, listen. To, to, to my breakfast club people, to the people out there... We pray in Jesus' name. We hope we hopefully Kanye comes back to normal. Oh my God! You know what I mean? But why did you but, hold on? Hold on, back up. <laughs> we don't want to mix these things in together. God right? just God just sent this one to the spam folder. No, <laughs> no exactly like that didn't happen. That went left don't mix fast. that in with the last prayer. Now put this prayer to the draft. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my bad, but listen, listen. You know, for real, you know, man. You know, man. Thank y'all for everything that y'all did. You know, for everyone's career, you know, you, 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 y'all come there with no ap- uh, apologetic journalism. I learned a lot from you guys, and I wish y'all guys the best in your endeavors. I, I'm, I'm, I already got the call to replace Angela Yee, but I said I'm, I got to chill. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, um, <laughs> but, yo, man, I, I really wish y'all the best, man, for real, man. Y'all real people, and y'all deserve y'all flowers. Y'all deserve everything y'all get. And uh, you, you, you continue to be great. And I can't wait to do your show. And I can't wait to do the new version of The Breakfast Club as well. Amen, y'all. One Amen. Time. Thank you, N.O. Let me do it. All right, Nori, love you, brother. Love, love y'all. Peace peace, peace, peace. All right. And there you have it. Lights are off. And it's a wrap. Oh well, no, we gotta the be here Monday. Not off. No, I mean, for you. <laughs> what are you lights talking are about? Me. No, they not. No, my lights are <laughs> the on. The lights are pretty, very much on. I mean, for uh, her. They're like show. brighter than ever. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what are you talking uh, about? Did we hear the Yee mix? A jersey goes Oh, we the heard it already. We played it already. All yeah. right. <laughs>
You're Do not making that flight. Play it again. Nope. <laughs> Jasmine, just remember to record it. Play it I got again, it. Sam. The Jasmine right. brand exclusive. All right, it's the Breakfast Club. Thank you, Yee. <laughs> Breakfast Club, bitches! Y'all finished or y'all done? <laughs> 